let's take a quick look on how to bring your own models and specifically how to import your LoRa. You can find the import LoRa node in the toolbox menu over here on the top left. You can drag it out or use the shortcut, right click anywhere on the canvas, type in LoRa and fetch the import LoRa node. After you fetch the node, click to upload, choose your LoRa and open. In this example, I've already imported two LoRa's. One would be my own LoRa and the other is like a super paint LoRa, which adds a painting style, specific painting style. Both are connected to Flux Dev LoRa model, which can be brought in the same way. Typing in Flux Dev LoRa will bring this model. And I've plugged in a text node with the prompt to the prompt input. The import LoRa goes into LoRa 1, the second LoRa goes into LoRa 2. And in order to control the power of the LoRa, I've added a number node, which can be found over here at the bottom at data types, or of course, through the quick search menu. Um, so for the first one, I'd use um, full power number one. For the super paint LoRa, I'd want to use a decimal number. So I'm opening up this show more button on the number node, changing it to float in order to have a decimal number option. These two numbers are plugged into the LoRa 1 scale and LoRa 2 scale, and then you can generate. There's an option on the Flux Dev LoRa model to uh, also have an image input uh, for reference and controlling the image strength over here at the bottom. So that would be the easy way to bring in your own LoRa. It will be saved in your workflow for um, usage in the future.